One year ago, I brought video game sellers back from the dead at a convention called PlayCon in Largo, Florida. Well, I am back here at Largo PlayCon, and welcome to episode 145 of Video Game Sellers. What's up, everybody? Man, it has been almost half a year since the last VGS episode. That was the one filmed at Really Rad Weekend where I hurt my back and my van's transmission died. So that was a really fun, awesome episode. But uh, hopefully nothing goes wrong here. The biggest thing is, is that Katie is back. Hi. What's up? It's been four and a half years Long time. since you have been in a VGS episode. We've, we've missed you here. I've missed it too. But have you missed like waking up really early and going and setting up at a convention? Not, like it's <laughs> nice now because it's been so long, but like doing it very often. I'm yeah, tired. when we were at the flea market all the time, that sucked. Yeah. So I am here also by myself. I've mentioned a, a few videos recently in the sense of like Dave is not here with me selling. He went fishing. He was supposed to be here, but he went fishing. Um, and then Eddie's not here, so the filming is going to be a little bit like this. Apologize. Old school. Old school. It's old school. If you're an old school fan, this is definitely going to look old school, real bumpy. It was maybe the last time I was in a video. Oh, yeah. was actually in this mode. It would have been all bumpy for sure. <laughs> and then, real quick, we're going to run over here because I don't have Dave and I, I don't have Eddie or Thomas, but instead we have Sean. Sean is re representing for, for Bonfire Games. Yep, there we go. So go check out Bonfire Games in Tampa if you're ever in the Tampa, Florida area. He's he's setting up right now. I've been here. Well, I've been haven't been here since last night, but I came last night for three hours to set up, and I came for four hours this morning to set up. So we're gonna show you the setup real quick. Quick tour of the booth. We have five dollar games. We have some NES games up here. Katie Vanna White, show us what we got. Look at all these random items, stacks of games, some figurines. I did that. Katie put all these little teeny figurines in this glass case. We got some Zelda shoes, tons of Switch things, some Resident Evil card games, a bunch of shiny stuff in these glass cases, plushies, some handheld systems. I literally brought any, like one of any possible type of item is out here. Movies, some old radios and Walkmans. What else we got, Katie? We got lots of keychains. We got, look at all these keychains and, and pins. pins. So Lanyards. many, a Chuck E. Cheese ruler. I mean, we've got it all. I mean, it's, it's just so <laughs> much stuff. We even have bags, like purses and posters. Amazing. So good. If you didn't watch the episode of VGS that I filmed here last year, it's a one day convention at a local rec center, but it's a huge rec center and it's actually a pretty decent sized convention. You have this whole side and upstairs all the way around. And then if we run over here, we have the side that I'm set up on over here, right over there, and all upstairs here. And then some outside, let's go check that out. And then outside you have a bunch of people set up and this is the trade day people. It's a Tampa Bay trade day. They uh, do multiple meetups throughout the year, but then they combine with Largo PlayCon and come and set up. And uh, it's a lot of like the local collectors. So you get a nice little taste in a variety of both like stores and businesses on the inside and then more of like the local gamers outside. A lady just handed me beads and I didn't have to show her anything. Would you, would you like the beads, Katie? Look, you don't have to show me anything either. It's okay. I, I have seen it, yeah. <laughs> First sale of the convention. State your name. Richard. Richard. He is buying Pikmin Uno and Dos, or one and two. Uh, a little kid. Oh, well, that's For nice. My... Lucas. Lucas? Lucas. Lucas isn't here. No. He's run away. He loves this game franchise. Well, you tell you, you said that you were a, you watch the videos also. Yeah, all the okay. time. Awesome. All and, the time. And he knows I work for Corn also, so he's like, you know, hey, we got a connection here. Yes, sir. Thank you very much for the purchase. Appreciate it. Just had a couple people, a blast from the past, show up. Haven't seen him for a long time. Old school viewers, other Joey. He's he's huge now. He's my height. It, and yeah, the hair adds a couple <laughs> inches. And and other Joey's dad. I mean, this is, I, f I feel like I'm, tw how long ago was that? Ten 29 years old again. <laughs> so, what are you doing these days? 
Oh, uh, working at a hospital, mostly. Saving people's lives? Are you a heart surgeon? No. Oh, okay. Almost. Almost a heart surgeon. <laughs> when they're not looking, he sneaks in and cuts some people open. Well, awesome seeing you, man. See you. Katie is not the one buying this, but no. the guy that's buying it uh, doesn't want to be on camera. It's his birthday, though, so happy birthday, man. Happy birthday! Yeah, he's over there. He's right over there. Uh, this PS3, like, promotional blanket that you can store your system in, and he's also buying the Zelda shield to go with it. Thank you! I've been selling a lot of posters so fast that I haven't been able to film them. So, a Secret of Mana poster looks real pretty. What's your name? Eddie. Eddie, thank you for the purchase. I'm gonna store this at the booth so he can walk around and not have to carry giant posters. While I spend more money. Yeah, yeah. Katie, I want to talk a little bit about our adventures and what yeah, we have so been, what we've been up to and what we will be doing. Uh, and also to plug your Instagram. What's your Instagram? Cat26 Photography. And that has a lot of nature photos on it. So if you're into nature at all, especially birds. Especially birds. Yes. Lately. We've been posting a lot of... If you go back, it's less birds. But recently, it's all birds. A lot of photos from our Costa Rica trip that we took this past December. And then this coming December, what are we doing? We're going to Ecuador. Ecuador for 16 days. Yep. Same thing, nature trip. 90% birds, 10% whatever else we end up seeing while we're there. And then um, maybe it's looking positive, but uh, in the beginning of 2025, hopefully Thailand. Oh my gosh. So, Dream. Yes, lots of nature and birding. Yeah. So keep an eye on her Instagram. If you like those kind of things, the link will be in the um, description section down below. Go hit the little follow Just button. Yeah. I always ask you guys a question in the VGS episodes to be answered in the comments down below. This episode's question is, have you ever done or do you plan on doing any nature-related traveling? Uh, going to like the national parks or maybe overseas? We, myself and Katie, always go like weekly to our local parks. And obviously we mentioned where you know we're going to be going. So there's your question. Answer it down below. And if you get this episode 500 likes in the first week that it's up, for seven days, I will do another game giveaway at the next convention we do which is literally only one week from now. So uh, 500 likes and leave a comment down below and be subscribed. But yeah, let's get those likes and uh, that way we'll give another signed copy of all the guests at the next convention, which is Game Jam South. Uh, we'll give that away. It'll be, of course, a um, WrestleMania, Titties on the Hulkster cartridge. So there you go, 500 likes, do it. Just made another sale, what's your name? Gabe. Gabe, and you have an Instagram, what is it? Trailblazer Cosplays. Trailblazer Cosplays. He's dressed up as the lovely Zelda. Ha ha ha. Link. Yes. Zelda, the greatest. Shield, of all time. sword, everything. And he bought a little Twilight Princess Zelda map. And what all Legend of Zelda players have to have a Sony Walkman. You know. Yeah, I love the 80s and 90s music. Listen to your tunes on the go. Thank you very much, man. Got a nice full booth at the moment, and Katie helping some people over there, making some sales. This is my friend Rich. Hey, what's up, everybody? You don't know Rich because when I wasn't filming for two and a half years, he was garage sailing with me. So you never got oh, to really cool. meet him. Yeah, I mean, it is what it is, but uh, you guys wish that I was in the video. Yeah, yeah. So he's one of the managers at Unlimited Video Games. I filmed a one-minute oh, oh crazy game store tour that was in his store. Uh, hey, the way it looks, that's all me, man. Yeah, yeah. It's all clean and stuff because he cleans it all. I do all of my Halloween stuff now for the last three years at their store. Awesome. We do a big haunted house every year. So if you're in the Tampa Bay area and like Halloween, not only check out Unlimited Video Games, but go there on Halloween so then you can see all of my Halloween props yeah, that yeah. they now have. Yeah. <laughs> my booth neighbor, I'm right over there, and he's right here, Frank. What's up, guys? With Premium Edition Games. They do, they do lots of new releases of Switch titles 
and the Just Switch. We're working on PlayStation as well, and we also do NES releases. Gotcha. Yeah, new aftermarket NES games. But we have, uh, we're really big on quality. We, uh, I personally vet pretty much all of our games, and I'm a hard ass about it. Um, <laughs> Show your newest one. My newest one right now would be Eagle Island Twist. It's bird this, related. Love Three and Raji are all part of the set that we just got produced and started sending out. And we got a Series 8 on pre-order for the website right now. Check out Premium Edition Games. Katie has acquired food for us. <laughs> Chicken strips and fries. Empanada. An empanada. I sold a Game Boy and Pokemon Blue while you were gone. Good job. Thanks. I think the biggest sale so far of the day. Just cranked a little over two hundred dollars. What do we got? What do we got? We got Street Fighters Two. Uh huh. We got Spider Man. Uh huh. We got the good old Mega Man X Two. X Two baby. That was a good chunk and of it. We got the Yoshi Island baby. There we go. What's your name, man? Anthony. Anthony, thank you very much. Yeah. Technically, oh, handshake. Let's get it. Technically, Katie made like half the sale, kind of, and I made the other half. So perfect. Right on. Thank you guys. Thanks. There's a live band playing. Shy. Hello. What have you sold so far? So, biggest item. Oh, biggest item yeah. is the first Prince uh, Pokemon Red. Okay. And then after that would be the Pokemon Stadium 2 complete in box on N64. Pokemon and Pokemon. Big surprise. Yeah. Come on, people. Like other games. <laughs> there are other things out there. Buy Halo. I've had 15 people ask, how much is Emerald? How much is Emerald? How much is Emerald? Yes. I also have, you know, Resident Evil games. There's some good uh, GameCube games. Get some have. good game. No one's really bought any GameCube. Mario Strikers. Okay. That's fun. Yeah, kick some balls. Yeah. <laughs> We're towards the end of the convention, about an hour and a half left. This gentleman drove an hour to get here. What's yeah. your name? Derek. Derek? Yes, sir. Pick up what you're grabbing. Grabbing a uh, Aquanet Time Master or uh, Collector's Edition, sorry. Super shiny cartridge. We've had it for a while. It's been touched and asked about many times. It's finally going to a new home. Uh, we did some cash and a little trade. I got Kirby Mass Attack on the DS and the Super Mario 3D All Stars on the Switch. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Going to a new, new home. Let's go. Bye. Let's go. Who's controlling you? Who's controlling you? Where is your home? Ha ha, you're stuck. You're stuck. <laughs> Rich is controlling. All right. There you go. You're free. I turn around, I'm like, I heard some, heard some weird noise. I turn around and there's a, a fencing competition going on in between all the vendor booths. Go join, Katie. <laughs> Another sale of some interesting items. We have the Xbox Live bag and a little N64 keychain that's like a voice recorder. I recorded to say, buy me. So he did. Uh, what's your name? Uh, Devin. Devin, thank you very much. Are you, are you enjoying PlayCon? It's good. It, it's loud in here though. You have to scream. What, what are we doing? We are saying hello to the people that watch this video because this is Erica and Erica puts on this whole event. How many years have you been doing it? Well, it would have been seven years without COVID, yeah. but this is the fifth year. Okay. So you have to excuse me, I'm not used to being at the side of the camera. Well, also I'm like, I have to duck way down because I think you're about three feet <laughs> tall. Yeah. But. Well, I'm grateful for you and everyone being here. And Thank hope you. everyone has had fun. I think everyone's, hopefully they have had fun watching people have fun and we didn't depress them. So, I hope so. Yes. I hope so, yes. Thank you again. All right, thanks. <laughs> Katie's been gone from the booth for about an hour now and she comes sneaking back and is shoving things. What are you, you have to show us what you bought. No, what, you're gonna... <laughs> what all did you buy? You're just loading. <laughs> you You just like made four handfuls of stuff into your bag. Show. Show the audience. All of it? Yeah, show all of it. I got dragon. We, a little rubbery. Oh no, it's hard. It's like, okay. Move. A little weird movie dragon. All right. Yeah. Next item, please. Okay. Along the same lines. Uh huh. They're like mini versions. It's a manatee. Oh, it's a little cute manatee. <laughs> Ew, and he's, he's in sections. He got hit by a boat. <laughs> 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 oh, Jesus. <laughs> what else? In a fox. In a little fox. 
cute. He also got hit by a boat. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I had stopped filming because I thought that was it. And then she's like, no, no, there's no more. There totally is more. What else is in there? Okay. Come on. I got... Hurry it up. A keychain. Oh, good Lord. <laughs> the hourglass. It's from the Final Fantasy XIV. Okay. And a... It's going to go on my board, but it's Akatar. At what? Don't worry about it. Okay. And, and there's then, more? Yeah, of course. <laughs> well, there goes any money we have made today. <laughs> so they're, so they're onigri, you know what that means. They're like rice balls. Uh-huh. And see the little like piece of seaweed? Yeah, yeah. So they're like little rice balls. Okay. Totoro. Cute. Came back for one more sale before the end of the day. We're getting a Hogwarts Harry Potter owl bag. A, I'm gonna say that wrong, Aragatsu purse. We got a little halo, uh, mega blocks or mega figs, little figurine. And to top it all off, a Sims 2 pets spiky dog collar. Aren't you excited? Yeah. Yes, very excited. Thank you again, man. Appreciate it. We are done. Okay. Largo PlayCon 2024 is, is over. It's mostly packed up. I'm always literally one of the last people in here. I'm losing, so stuff. losing my voice. I do have so much stuff and it's only about half packed up. So we're gonna say bye to you uh, so I can finish this. Don't forget, get the video 500 thumbs up, 500 likes in this next week, please. And we will do a game giveaway for you guys. And uh, you know, leave a comment and subscribe and dance and do all the other uh, dumb crap that people ask you to do on YouTube, so. Love you. Talk to you later. Peace. Squish. 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 Squish the head. Baba Booey.